All right, man, Tall Guy Car Views back with another legendary video, baby. What's taking place? You see the Ram Reezy in the back looking real greasy, man. You see Kinks in there matching the whip. Of course you do, man. Let's start the video, baby. Come on, get up in there. Good boy. That. Good boy. Good job. All right, G Squad, man. Come on, y'all know what time it is, man. Back with another legendary one today, man. You see, look at the sun's out. It's shining. I woke up. My arms are moving. My legs are moving. My brain is operating at full capacity. I can see out my eyeballs, man. Life is great, man. Life is big time good. It ain't because none of the shit I got, man. It's good because I woke up and I got my health. Now it's time to get to the wealth. So, G Squad, y'all probably wondering what we doing today, man. Well, I got a whole bunch of errands I'm running like every other single day, man. So, everybody just stay tuned throughout the whole video. No skip one ad, please. I greatly appreciate it. G Squad, that goes to y'all, man. Anybody else, I don't expect nothing from you if you ain't G Squad. But if you G Squad, I greatly appreciate it. Thank you very much. But I'm going to mail off some merch right now. Shout out to all the G Squad uh, subscribers who have bought the merch and support the movement, man. Stay tuned because I got more merch coming your way. But right now, I'm about to head to the post office, pick up some stuff out of my P.O. box. If you send some dope shit to my P.O. box, I'm going to open it up, make a video out of it. But don't be sending me no weird stuff. Some people be sending some crazy stuff, man. But I'm headed there right now. So I'm going to check that when I get there. And then I got to mail off the merch that the people bought already, the G Squad members. Shout out to y'all. Y'all know who you are. Appreciate you very much. But then after that, I'm going to Stillwater Ferry because I got to pick up my license plates. And I got, you know, a little business move, a little venture, business venture being made, man. But everybody stay tuned for June 24th, too. So June 24th, I'm hosting my own event at Stillwater Ferry, man. So if you're G Squad, you want to have a good time, you want to meet me, you want to come kick it with me, like I said, any person is invited. Anybody, whoever wants to come, you invited. You got a YouTube, you invited. You got a dope car, you invited. You don't have a car, you ride the bus, you invited. You a troll, you invited. I don't care who you are, you're invited June 24th, Stillwater Ferry in Stillwater, Minnesota. Make sure you're there, man. But then after that, I gotta go up to High Tech More Sport, drop this box off my oil catch can so Bart can put that on the Hell Keezy, man. Hell is getting real crazy right now, man. So everybody stay tuned for the outcome of that, too. That should be done either within the next couple days or maybe even tomorrow. Ain't no telling, but I'll give y'all an update once I get to High Tech Motorsport. Got more errands run throughout this video, so everybody stay tuned, man. All right, G-Squad, we back, mailed off the merch, man, huh, King? How you feeling, boy? You all right? Yeah, he's just chilling with Papa. You cool. But I just mailed off that merch, man. Like I said, shout out to all the G-Squad subscribers who have bought their merch. www.talkicarviews.com. Uh, I almost forgot that. So now I'm at the Stillwater Ferry, man. So without further ado, I'll see you when I get there, man. Go on. All right, y'all. So I know I said I was going to go to Stillwater Ferry first, but I didn't. I'm here at High Tech Motorsport, man. So let's get up in here and let's get it going. Look at King. King knows exactly where we at. Come on, boy. Come on. Go get him, boy. Go get him. Look. <laughs> Where's he at, King? Where's Bar? Where's he at? Where's he at, boy? Where you go, King? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he, King? Where's Bart at, boy? Go get him. Wait, he's over there. Yeah, he knows exactly where he's at now. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> what are you doing? He's looking for you. What's, What's going on, going? Bart? What's my you go swim in the lake? Did I see you in the lake? Yeah, I put him in the lake. Lake? Yeah. <laughs> we even jumped into you. was right there. That water is freezing. I told you. Yeah, that. you said it though. Because Bart got a boat, so we're going to go on a boat with Bart, man. So everybody stay tuned for that, man. Bart told me it was freezing before we got the boat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I knew what was going to happen. I'm like, yeah. Oh. Look. <laughs> yeah. Look. <laughs> hey, let's go get you a treat. I know. He loved Bart. Come on, boy. Come on. Yeah, always about the trees. Look at and these floors. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Somebody say treats? You excited? You excited? Yeah, I know. You like it here. All right, y'all. We got to go ahead and get the, um, whatchamacallit, thingamajigger out of here. Shut this joint right here and get this to bark. For those who don't know, this is my oil catch can for my Hellcat, my Hellkeezy, man. So I got to get this to bark so I can put that on there. Come on, boy. Come on, this way. Come on, come on, come on. Go get it, go get it. Let go crazy. Boy. Whoa, that's not snacks. Got the hell Keezy right here, man. Look at King going crazy. What you want, boy? What? I know, I know, I know, I know. It's okay. Look at that joint, man. Look at clean. It's coming together, man. We got some things happening to the Hellcat, man. Everybody just stay tuned. Got the colder intake, man. Got all the stuff happening, man. Everybody just relax. Thousand horses to the wheel, man. No, I'm just playing. Thousand horses to the crank. About 800 or something to the wheel, man. Everybody stay tuned, man. Everybody stay tuned for this review, too, because me and Bart are about to do a review on this joint today. Look how big them damn tires is. King, you get on my way, please. Thank you very much, champ. There you go. Look at them tires, man. Got the green inside sides and all that good stuff and he's got this joint souped up and beefed up man so everybody stay tuned for this review whether it goes up tomorrow the day after that or whatever just stay tuned for this review because it's about to be legendary they finally done with this y'all not done with this no it, it, it broke a whole bunch of stuff in it oh damn bro what happened uh i'll show you here it broke the rear end oh damn look like the tire flat too oh, I left the air, uh, you gotta let the air 
up here and the failure is to take the wheels off. Oh, okay. That look crazy. Look at King, he don't know what the hell that sound is. Oh, damn. The differential? Yeah, or not the differential, the drive shaft? It broke the drive shaft and it completely grenaded the rear end hose. Damn. So it broke the differential and the drive shaft. Yeah, well, yeah, the differential broke and then it broke the drive shaft. Uh, damn. That's the pinion. Duh, it really exploded type, huh? Yeah. Twisted it's... the metal and all that? Yeah. Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> Shit. Now we're going to uh, fix all that stuff. Yeah, that's crazy. How the hell did something like this happen? It takes a lot of power now, and this wasn't up to the task. So. Uh, so I got to get a new drive shaft and a differential now. Yep. Damn, that's crazy. This ain't going to happen to my Hellcat, is it? We hope not. Shit, oh yeah, we gotta replace that drive shaft. Bart said we was gonna replace the drive shaft, though. Yeah, I think that's uh, on, uh, on the menu. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna talk to him about that today. The, the, the drive shaft in the Hell Keys is definitely gonna get replaced. And then as far as the differential, I think he told me to get like a brace or something for it to lock it in. Yeah, they, I think they make a brace for it or something. Yeah. That's probably fine. Yeah, I got the oil catch can right here, too, for my Hellcat. Oh, there you go. Yeah, so I gotta give that to him. That matters. It ain't as big as this kind of shit, but <laughs> it's a mod for me. It'll help. Yeah, it'll help. So listen, man, I was over here talking to Bill and Chris, and I was telling them, like, man, that's exactly why I don't do mods, and tell them what you just told me. Well, I mean, we could have definitely prevented this by putting a higher quality drive shaft in here and, uh, you know, a, a different rear end. It's hard to say. That could have lasted forever. This might have not ever happened, but it's one of those things where you can just prevent it and put good parts in the damn thing. To he was probably it. trying to save bread, though, huh? Right. Well, yeah, I mean, just time, time and money. No yeah, means, so. but ultimately he should have just bought the shit because now no matter what he's kind of all tied up into it now I'd rather do it on your terms than when your car break down type terms you know what I mean yeah yeah, yeah. I mean he got, he got to the track with it he, he had a good time with it until it broke so damn and then now you got to call a damn tow truck that shit is whack <laughs> so I got this uh, oil catch can for my Hellcat look at King going crazy I got the oil catch can for my Hellcat okay. hey get down hey Stop. Eat this too? Okay. He thinks it's a damn snack. My guy told me to get that. So I was like, damn, you know what? Why y'all doing all that pulley and shit? Maybe we can just slap that on there. You know what I mean? Appreciate it, man. <laughs> he don't never learn, does he? He likes it. He does. He's fun. Bart got them all riled up. Oh, now it's my fault. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the instigator. That's what I Look. <laughs> go get it, boy. Go get it. Go. Look. <laughs> <laughs> What's that, boy? Go get Okie. <laughs> he just likes going back and forth. <laughs> Calm down. You should get hurt. It's, yeah, it's like a kid on the ice rink. I swear he loves it. Look at his tail. Look. Yeah, I know, right? All right, so I seen the Mustang. The drive shaft blew up and the differential blew up, mm. right? Yeah. And we are getting a differential for my Hellcat, right? And you're thinking a carbon fiber. No. Uh, not differential. I'm sorry. Uh, drive shaft. That's it. Right. So we're going to get the carbon fiber drive shaft for the Hellcat. Yep. Okay, how much that's gonna run? Uh, I think cost, and then they sell them for like 1800 bucks, and I'm gonna get the deal for you, just cause it's you. <laughs> yeah, my man, <laughs> I need that. I think it's gonna be like $1,100 or something. Like okay. That. Unfortunately, oh. it's a lot of money. You know, the Mustang didn't break the drive shaft first. It right, actually the differential the blew, right? Yeah, tore yeah. the nine inch into little pieces when he came off the trans brake at 5,500 RPM. So when it twisted, the gears, the differential, and the little pieces, which you probably took pictures of that out there, you probably should, it's laying on the ground. Right. When that came apart, making 900 horsepower, 750 foot-pounds of torque. With them big-ass tires. Yeah, you came off the button where it's like, ah, bleh. Damn, that ain't gonna help it to the Hellcat, though. No. Okay. You don't have, you don't have a trans brake. So okay. Trans brake, what happens is you push the button, it locks first gear. The Dodge Demon type stuff. Yes. That's it. Right. You call it a launch control or whatever. That's the girl's name for a, yeah. <laughs> so okay. when you hit that, what it does, it locks first gear and reverse in the automatic. So they can't go anywhere. They just sit there and they shake. The whole car goes, moves all over the place. Right. You let go of the button and the thing goes, yep, reverse gear is all off. Now go ahead, go forward. Whap. And that shit just went boom. Yeah, spit all over the ground. Damn. I want all people to know I did the engine and the transmission. The guy didn't want to do the rear end. And and you told him about that. I remember you telling me that. Yeah, but he's trying trying to save them pennies, man. Yep. This is car stuff, though, yeah, right? So he snapped the the transmission's broken the center too, because when the drive Damn. shaft came out, it snapped in half and it banged the bottom of the car and it snapped the, the back of the transmission. Strap well, actually strapped the cracked the case. So that's going to be a thousand dollars for the case plus we got to put all the parts in the transmission it's about sure to be a bag huh he's probably with the new 40 spline strange rear end uh, or strange um, center section and the drive shaft he's going to drop close to 10k 
Damn. Oh, that hurts my damn soul. Damn. Ooh. Okay. Shoo, shit. Everybody relax, man. Ten bands. Damn. Yeah, that's that old sphincter closing owie type thing. That, yeah. You know, save, he saved, uh, he got the rear end from his buddy, the third member that was off of a dirt track racer deal, and it wasn't up to the task. When you can when you can twist metal out, you're making enough power. So are, are you going to make a video about that and put it on your YouTube channel? Oh, I, I was just going to do, I'm doing camshafts next, yep. and we're doing the, the Mustang, the purple Mustang back there. We're changing the camshaft. I was going to lay that out for all the people so we could we could talk about the differences in camshafts and the way they work and power, and we'll dyno it up, and then we'll take it for a spin. I fired it up, and I took a um, video of that. Yeah, I see your GoPro right there. Yeah, I sir, see take it, it all yeah. over the bathroom to me. Cool. It's like, guess what I'm doing? <laughs> Where's the man, yo? <laughs> so let's order the um the drive shaft. Sure. How long how long it would it take to get here? About a week. Okay. About the same yeah. time you get you have your computer stuff back from unlocking by the end of the week, and we'll be ready to rock and roll with that by you know early next week type stuff. And we'll okay. Be, we'll be on with everything. We'll install the drive shaft. You can take a video of that. Got to put the blower pulley on once everything else is here, so we can put it in the back again. And you can you can look at that. It's pretty cool stuff. The level we're doing is the thousand horse level, where you do not have to replace fuel system, do not have to replace injectors or the blower. Oh. Can they go farther? Sure, but this one I know I can put you in. You can drive all over the country at 200 plus miles an hour and feel good about yourself, and you'll be fine. That's what I want. I don't want that Mustang back there. I want the reliability, you want to spend the durability. Ten grand? I mean, Hell no, nah. nope. 10 grand, I'm out of here, Bart. Money guy. <laughs> Hell no, I wish. <laughs> you ready, King? Hmm? You ready, boy? Come on, get up in there. Go. Good boy. Good job. <laughs> All right, man. So now, what y'all didn't get to see off camera was the fact that that drive shaft was ordered up. Got a carbon fiber drive shaft for the Hellcat. So everybody stay tuned. Got the carbon fiber drive shaft now. Got the full exhaust. Got the headers. Got the cold air intake. What else I put on? Got the pulley. Got the tune. Thousand plus horsepower, man. You know what I mean? Come on, everybody relax, baby. But now I am headed to Stillwater Ferry. Got to go up there, orchestrate this event that I got going on June 24th. And then I also got to grab my license plates for the Ram Reezy. Long overdue. Should have been did it, but damn, that place is far. So without further ado, I'm going to turn this camera around, play some boobity bop 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 for y'all. Y'all going to rock to the beat, and then I'll see y'all when I get to Ferry, man. Go on. What's up, champ? How you feeling, man? What's up? Say what's up to the two, man. Look, King wants to say hi too. Oh, wow. Look. <laughs> yeah, you get big quick. Eh? June 24th, we still on for that, right? For the event. Everybody coming now, Dale. The whole thing gonna be packed out. They gonna clear out all this right here, y'all. So it's gonna be going around the whole dealership, right, Dale? Yeah, we have a show on the 15th, and then you're... y'all got a car show here on the 15th. Yeah. So okay. Okay, right before the event that matter the most. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Lord. So it's like a pre warm up to the to the real. Okay, that's what you see. Oh, you like that? That's yeah, killed the one. <laughs> Go ahead and tell him, Vito. What you talking about, man? Huh? I just want to be in the loop. You know what I'm saying? I guess we got a little event going on on the 24th. Well, you know how you want to, you want to know how you could be in the loop, brother? You hit that subscribe I'm button, subscribe. watch the ad, hey, and I'm the whole damn video, and you would know what's happening June 24th. I'm just going to put this yeah, shit on replay all day. So Vito appalled because he ain't yeah, know June 24th. I get an invite, I get a special guest appearance. I brother, you work here. Cool. I see how it 
it is, man. We'll be here anyway. Zach, you, you know, huh? I knew, I knew about it the whole time. See, that's because Zach be... Uh, yeah, because Zach knows because... Zach knows because he's been watching all the videos, watching the ads. He G-Squad. Yeah. I watch the videos, man. I just those recent videos. Sorry, but I'll be here. I'll come back with a... What's the last video you watched? Put him on the spot. Which last one? Uh, it's so many. Yeah, man. <laughs> Look at <laughs> See, I'm thinking it's Zach. Look how crazy that is. You know, what the hell, man? You're supposed to be Northside, man. What's happening, man? It's hard to think. You know, i just be doing the work. Northside is supposed to support Northside, brother. I'll be forgetting. You know, I'm a part of those 60,000 views and those 200 something subscribers, <laughs> man. Okay, all right. Let me know something then. June 24th is happening here, man. You gonna be here, Bino? I'm gonna be here. I come back on the 21st. I'm gonna be in the Okay, all right. Let me know something, brother. What about you, Zach? You gonna be here? I'll be here. I'll oh, be here. Okay. Well, everybody stay tuned. June 24th, man. Be here, Stillwater Fury. All right, y'all. As you can see, tall guy. I'm back in the flesh, baby. Just left Stillwater Fury, man. We shopped there, up there, chopping up with my dog, Bino and Dale. Everybody up there, Stillwater Fury. Shout out to them, man. Real cool people. Not just at this location, but every location that is Fury. I rock with them heavily, man. Y'all already know that. But June 24th, we're up there orchestrating the events. What I do got to let y'all know is the things that I got going on June 24th, I'm going to have a lot of big surprises, man. I'm going to have some contests, some people out there doing music. It's going to be a lot of festivities taking place, potentially food trucks and all that good stuff, man. So everybody stay tuned. It's about to be an epic event, man. Everybody come. Bring cash because don't nobody accept card, man. But it's about to be a legendary day, man. That's for damn sure, man. We got big festivities happening. I am going to do a burnout in my Hellcat there. So everybody stay tuned for that. Just got big things playing, man. And I got more people coming that y'all don't necessarily know about. So everybody just stay tuned, man. Because like I told you, it's going to be a legendary day. I had to go get King some food. You know, he liked that food right there. I got to mix it in with his dog food. He liked it when it's all chopped suey up like that, man. But what I just got done doing, man, I left a place here in Minnesota. One of my subscribers told me to go to. They got like this package deal, right? Y'all want to know how taxing this truck is to get it built up the way I want? Ten grand for we're talking about for a super like prime good time lift, uh, rims and tires. We're talking about thirty eight tires, twenty four inch rim. I think seven and a half inch lift kit with like a good like coil overs and all this whole other stuff and suspender things, whatever the hell all that stuff is. I'm still learning about the trucks and all that stuff. But long story short, it's gonna be a bad. You got to know that we talking ten grand minimum just for rims and tires and because you know, i need the big joints they got to be looking crazy and we're talking for just the lift so you got to know that man it's about to be a substantial bag being spent man so everybody stay tuned for everything that's going to be happening tomorrow i'm doing a muffler delete on the ram reezy y'all been asking me to do a muffler delete on the ram reezy for a long time man so i'm just gonna go ahead put a trick on that i'm not gonna lie to y'all i've been kind of holding off on the muffler delete on the on the ram because i just feel like it don't even go fast, so why would I? I mean, it's relatively fast. It got a 5.7 liter V8 and all that good stuff, but it ain't Hellcat fast. So for it to be making all that noise, I'll be like, I always thought the most embarrassing cars ever on the planet was the ones who go slow as hell but got a loud ass exhaust and they hitting the gas and they going nowhere, but it sounded like they're doing 100 miles an hour. So that's kind of why I've been holding off on the muffler delete on the Ram Razy, man. But we are gonna see um, tomorrow. That's tomorrow's video, so everybody stay tuned for that. And then from there, if the muffler delete sound cool, then I might do a straight pipe. I don't know, we'll see, man. But none of really else talk about this video, man. Everybody stay tuned for the things I got going on with the Ram because this is about to be legendary for sure. And it's also going like I said, I'm gonna keep saying it. It's gonna cost a bag. So for anybody out there who's getting a uh, pickup truck, not just a Ram, it could be a Chevy truck, a Ford Raptor, a Ford, whatever it is. No, before you get into it, it's gonna cost a substantial bag. And I knew that too before I got my Ram because I kind of looked into that stuff, so I knew it was gonna be expensive. But I'm like, you know what? Maybe I can finagle get something to work out. But right now, it's looking like I'm just gonna have to go cold hard cash, man. So everybody stay tuned, man. But without further ado, this video is over. It's done. Slim, tall guy, car views, baby. I'm out of here, man.